Hello everyone. Today I'm going to be demonstrating another MEL resource called Novelist Plus. Novelist Plus is an excellent resource if you are trying to find your next read, especially if there was a particular author you very much enjoyed and you're a little leery or worried about moving to a different author. Novelist Plus does an excellent job of matching up read-alikes um, in terms of what the theme is for the different books as well as the author styles and character styles. So once again you're going to go to your favorite internet browser. Mine is apparently Chrome and I'm going to go to mel.org again so mel.org and we are going to go to e-resources and under the public libraries tab you will already see Novelist Plus there and you will go ahead and click that And so let's search for a title. And I'm gonna actually going to use the example they have here, Life of Pi. And you will see results pop up. And so the one we're looking for is right here in the first. And let's say I'm looking for title read-alikes. So I'm going to open in a new tab again, the title read-alikes. And it lists nine of them. And what you will notice is that the book you searched, it's going to give a short synopsis, and then it's going to list your top nine with the author, and then also the reason why this is a read-alike for The Life of Pi. Not only does it do title read-alikes, but it will also do author read-alikes. And again, it will give the author's name, a little bit about the author and then the list top nine list of other authors and the reasons why those will appeal to those of a certain author preference not only that but there is a series search in novelist so let's look at the in death series by jd rapp also known as nora roberts And if you click on said series, and what you'll notice, it will also list that the most recent publication, which is February 2021. When you click on this series, it will give you the full list of everything that is in this series. The only thing I notice here, since I read this series, is that I don't see the novellas listed. It is possible that they have the novellas listed at the end, or if they were in an anthology, they might be listed at some point there. But they might just, not, it is very possible they might just not bother with the novellas at all. Yeah, it's not looking like they are, and that's okay. What you can do, so not, so notice again, you still have your title read-alikes, you have your author read-alikes, but you also get series read-alikes and so again, I'm going to open that in a new tab. And so it will give you the series. It will give you the synopsis for the most part of the entire series. And then again, it will give you the top nine read-alikes. Um, and again, the reason. So the In-Death series, if you're not aware, is kind of a futuristic murder mystery with a little splash of romance. And the reason why it's recommending Anita Blake Vampire Hunter is because the two lead female characters in each series are very similar to one another. And the paranormal aspects of the Anita Blake series would appeal to those who appreciated the futuristic aspects of the in-death books. So the next time that you are looking for your next read, hopefully you check out Novelist Plus, and we look forward to seeing you in the library. Have a nice night. Thanks for watching.